The Las Vegas lights and pressure were on Derek Carr and the Raiders to get back in the win column against the Chiefs on Sunday night. Carr is pressured on second and goal. He delivers a great pass to Hunter Renfro in the corner of the end zone to tie things up. The former BC Eagle threw for 261 yards. Carr told reporters post game that he wanted to take shots down the field in the second half. He fires a 37 yard strike to Brian Edwards. The Raiders did damage through the air, but they could not get their run game or defense going. Carr finishes the Las Vegas Raiders leading a rusher with 18 yards. Patrick Mahomes did MVP things on Sunday night. He escapes the pressure and throws a touchdown only he could throw. Mahomes torched the Raiders for five touchdowns. The Raiders dropped their second game in a row and are struggling after the bye week for another season. But Carr says he thinks this group can pull it together. Uh, I just really believe in our group. Close, it's a close group. You know, football, you got to be tight. You got to do it together. Um, the things that we messed up today, I mean, it's so, so correctable, you know, um, you know, I think that's what gives me, you know, like, oh yeah, we could do it. It wasn't like we just got out manned, you, you know what I'm saying? Like I'm trying to describe it that way. Um, you know, I, I, I really believe that, you know, um, that this group is just different. It's just being around them. I'm, I'm around them every day. It's just a different group. Jordan Love on the bench as Aaron Rodgers returned from COVID. Rodgers connects with former Fresno State Bulldog Devontae Adams for a nice gain. He had seven catches for 78 yards. Bakersfield's Chris Barnes and the Packers defense had themselves a game. The Liberty grad had five tackles against Seattle. The Packers also picked off Russell Wilson twice. Green Bay gets back in the wing column with a shutout led by Barnes and the defense. The Roadrunners had a 25-point win against Life Pacific in the team's home opener Saturday night. It was the team's first win of the season, and it was also 350 career wins for head coach Rod Barnes. After the game, Barnes got a jersey to celebrate the big victory. He is in his 11th season with the Roadrunners. He helped lead Bakersfield to conference titles, NIT, and NCAA appearances, and Barnes was very thankful on Saturday night about the milestone. It's been a lot of good times with a lot of young men. A lot of coaches, so I'm thankful for that. Um, not many coaches get an opportunity to win 350 games, so uh, to have done that it says something about the people. I want to thank my family. I just feel blessed. Uh, it feels good to be able to, to contribute to his 350 uh, wins. You know, he's a, a great coach, and uh, you know, it's his blessing to be able to play for a coach like Coach Rob Barnes. Yeah, it's definitely special. Um, I feel blessed to just be a part of this program and just be able to play for him. So um, to be able to do that for him is, is, is definitely great. For your morning sports update, I'm Adrian Luevanel.